So we've heard um, or seen a couple comments where people are like, yeah, it's, you know, this route, this route setting is cool, but we want to see more climbing. So today we're just going to be doing a lot of hard bouldering. So we have um, some problems that are already up in the gym, and then I've also thrown up some hard climb climbs. So we have a black one that's very compression focused, so a little bit technical. We have a blue one that is very dynamic, a little bit more coordination, tricky top. And then we have green, which is more like some crimps, just nice flowy movement. So we're gonna start on the green one. I think it comes in around 7B, 7B plus. So we'll just have a little bit of an easier one to get started. But yeah, I think uh, we're gonna throw uh, Robin up on it first. Uh, well, I guess I have to go first. I'm pissed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to fall. I want to. I want to send the problem. <laughs> Damn. You worried, bro? Um, actually not. Uh, what I'm mostly worried about is forgetting the beta. <laughs> 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 uh, it was a nice 7B, it was uh, right up my alley, that was fucking hard. Yeah. <laughs> I think it looks super sick. It's definitely a king line, as me and Eric would say. It's, uh, yeah, it's a straight up classic. 
it looks beautiful. So I'm stoked to try it, but I know that there's a lot of hard moves waiting for me. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm stoked to try hard. Not too bad. I think yeah. it looks better, worse than it is. It doesn't look that bad, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> it's a red. It's a, it's a flash wound, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Almost up there. I'm gonna have to optimize the beta for the top. I thought you could say I have to operate this thumb. <laughs> yeah, maybe I can. <laughs> EKB is like, can't you just camp this to the top? But I made sure that the right hand is really rotated. So it looks like it's okay, but you really need to take it from a very side poi way, which is why you have the toe and then the heel, is that it really helps the body get into the position so the right hand is good. So really it's, you have the right hand there when you're kicking out the toe, but all of your weight is on the left hand in the bicep. So I'm glad that it shouldn't go to break it. I usually say that and then Robin comes in and she's like, Boom! It felt uh, more secure now. I thought about the thumb and it felt, it felt better, but it's of course uh, a high possibility to fall there. It's a weird move. Do you have any inspiring words here? <laughs> no. <laughs> Come here, <Robert>. oh, <laughs> Fuck, my weak. Yeah, I fell again. <laughs> <laughs> Inside. <laughs> <laughs> but it was very nice, a good boulder. Thank you. It was, uh, yeah, a lot of unique uh, movements, especially with a double toe hook. Can't wait for the next one. Oh no, you don't, yeah, you don't know what's waiting around the corner, my friend. So we're gonna jump into the next dynamic one. And we'll see if it burns skin or not. That's a desperate up there. <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> 
<laughs> oh. oh shit. Thank God. Because I have taped up fingers. I was sliding on the crib. Going up with the left. Oh, yes. I think it's because there's so many like sensitive positions and moves. They're also very like physical. That's uh, it makes it so like position based. So it's really hard and it keeps going. I don't know why, but it's it really feels like a benchmark problem. If you want to climb like a grade, this for example, I suggested 8A. It feels like a benchmark 8A. That was solid. Nice work, Nikki. Mm. Where the green one comes in around 7C, I think the black one comes in around 7C plus, and then this one comes in as 8A. So it's nice, we got like a good spread of styles, good spread of grades. So this is a boulder that was actually set up by our friend Yemen when he was up here a couple weeks ago. So uh, I've seen on Insta, got stoked, so I'm gonna go in for the flash. Robin's given me some, some pointers on what to think about. I've looked at it, I've tried to feel the move on the ground, of course, <laughs> not to spoil the flash, so I'm just going to go in and hope for the best. It's uh, quite a violent move to try and get everything to land up. So we'll see. I'll probably, I'm going to climb up, grab the hold and just feel what the human flag position looks like. Crazy. It felt really hard to establish in the position. So we'll see. I might just have to blast out some tries. See how it feels. Maybe wait for Robin to show me how it's done. <laughs> You've been taping those fingers for a long time, Robin. Uh, it's a lot of fingers, man. What can I say? The top wasn't anything special. Should be fine. Once you do the first move, you're done. Yeah. No! <laughs> so sick. Yeah. But that's what I mean. You really have to hit it right and get the shoulder up because otherwise you're gonna end up like that and not hold the position. So, um, I only have one or two more fit tries. I'm starting to feel my finger a bit. So I'm gonna be smart, cut it off. So we'll see. Either I do it now or I go home and cry. Come here, Robin. No, taper. 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 The safe. I felt uh, when I grabbed the crimp, and I felt uh, it felt like I was slipping. So I got really spooked, 
and lost all my concentration and all my technique as you saw. Uh, yeah, it was uh, it was a chance, but I did it. <laughs>